How to fix blurry video in CapCut Hi everyone, welcome back. This is a video tutorial on how to fix blurry video in CapCut. To get things started, let's open CapCut. From CapCut, tap on New Project and then select the video you'd like to edit from your camera roll. So we have this video right here, it's a little bit blurry and you have two options in order to fix this. The first one is by using a filter. So at the bottom where you can see all the editing options, you can see effects. Yeah, oh, not sorry, not effects, but filter. You have to tap on filter and then tap on video quality. And as you can see, you have two options right here. You have remove flickers and reduce image noise. So all you have to do is tap on remove flickers and you can just adjust this to recommend or most stable. Let's try recommend. And as you can see, this image is currently processing and now it's completed. We can also reduce the image noise to make, to make the quality of this video better. So let's select strong. And as you can see, it completed as well. So once done, just tap on the check mark at the bottom right corner of the page. And this video should look a little bit better compared to how it used to. However, that filter is actually not for free. It's only for the pro version of CapCut. So another option you can try is by doing this. So I'm going to exit out of this project and start a new one. Use the same video. Add this video. And then I'm going to make use of um, one of our effects here. So tap on effects and then video effects. Go to, uh, let's go to, where is that? Comic. And then scroll down, look for B and W sketch. Now tap on the check mark right here and make sure that the effect is aligned to the whole video. And tap the video to also adjust the sharpen to 100. Now tap on the check mark at the bottom to save the changes. And then just tap on effects again. Let's look for effects. All right, Let, let's, yeah, there you go. So effects, and then tap on lens and look for blur. Tap on blur and then tap on the check mark. Make sure that it is aligned to the main video and then export this. All right, now let's go back to the project and then let's change BMW sketch to neon. So let's tap on replace effect and then change it to neon. Tap on the check mark and just make sure it's aligned before we export this one as well. Now let's go back to the project again. Delete all the effects we added. And now we have to add the clips we saved earlier. So we have the sketch and the Let's try to add this sketch first. Tap on sketch and then at the bottom look for overlay. So let's look for overlay here. There you go. And then let's try to add the other video and look for overlay again. So let's look for overlay here. There you go. So make sure that they're all aligned again and looks like they are. Now uh, let's go back and tap on um, one of the um, overlays. Let's start with sketch, tap on blend, and then you have to tap on burn. Change it to 30 to 45. For this video, I'll use 45. And then let's save the changes by tapping on the check mark. Now let's do the same for the neon um, overlay. Tap on blend. Um, but this time use dodge and then just change it to at around 50 to 60. So for this video, I'll use 60, then tap the check mark as well. So as you can see, the quality of this video is now a little bit better compared to earlier. And you can even make it better by um, adjusting some of the settings here 
um, the color. So you can in you can increase or decrease the brightness, contrast as well. So for this part, um, there's really no specifics anymore. It depends on the video you are editing. After that, just tap on the check mark and then tap on the uh, save button at the right top corner of the page. And you should now see this on your camera roll. So as you can see, this was our original video. And this is our edited one. So much better. And that's how you fix blurry video in CapCut. If you found this video helpful, please let us know in the comments below. Like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.